hello everyone welcome back to our youtube channel agri edit so in this video i am going to talk about the cut pg exam the counseling for the 2025 so we are getting like a lot of doubts and questions from the students regarding the cutoff for the bhu for this year what will be the cutoff for this year and what was the cutoff for the previous year for the few major important disciplines of agriculture so to address this like i'll be coming up with i have come up with this video in which in detail i'll be talking about the different steps and different things that you have to take care of and what are the departments under this bhc counseling and how the bhc counseling is related to the cut pg exam everything at about the cut pg exam and the bhc counseling will be covered in this video so to get a maximum benefit watch the complete video till the end okay so to start with if you know about the cut pg exam this is all india entrance exams conducted for the msc for the various disciplines not only for the agriculture but it also includes the agriculture here in case of agriculture you can write the cut pg exams and you will be eligible to apply for the different universities that are there in india like uh, deemed universities like state agri state universities or uh, central universities or you can also go for the private institutes or the government institutes in all of the all of these institutes or the universities you will be able, eligible to apply if you write this cut pg exam okay for the subjects of agriculture fine so in this the most important the university is it's about the bhu why the bhu is the only one which is actually accredited by the icr for the msc for ug you will find many for pg like bh is the one which is accredited by the icr and mostly the students who are willing to crack this exams or preparing for this exams will target to go for bh for various disciplines so we'll talk about like what are the different disciplines that you can you will be eligible in case of bh what are the different disciplines that are available in the field of agriculture and also like what will be cut off for the different subjects to so just to like have a comparison between the two different events for, for previous year and this year this is 2025 and uh, this is 2024 so if you know like the application was released in the previous year between the december 26 to january 24 and similarly similar dates like it was from 2nd of january to 1st of february although not entirely same but the events match with each other so why i am saying this based on that you can also predict like when you will get the scorecard from the cut pg exam for 2025 based on 2024 and exam like regarding the exam when was the exam conducted the exam was conducted on the 11th march and it started from 11th of march to 28th of march and here the exam started in the month of uh, march again it is 13 to 31st okay almost same next like you got the key answer now recently in the month of april so by the end of march the exam was completed and by the last week of april so you got your key answers and uh, this key answer was in the april so after the release of key answers within 10 to 15 days you will be getting the cut scorecard okay you will be getting scorecard and here the important thing to know here is like the cut will the nta will release the scores it will be total for 300 marks so if you have write, written this exams it will be total for 300 marks and for 300 marks you will be given a score based on which you can apply for the counseling in the bhu so this is and this marks or the scorecard you can expect in next 10 to 15 days or mostly by 20 days okay so this is everything about cut pg exam and if you know like you will be writing a major paper which the most of the agriculture students write the main paper or the first paper is with the code sqp01 see if you are writing this exam so then you will be eligible to apply for the following subjects okay and uh, for the other this is for agriculture science and uh, 02 is agroforestry and these are the agriculture and allied subject so if you are willing to pursue your msc from any of the subjects you have to pick up these quotes and you have to write this exams and hopefully like you have done it done the same okay next it's about the participating universities as i told you like if you have already written the cut pg exams you are getting very good score in that no matter like what is the score so for 300 you are getting some score and you are willing to take admission for the msc in any of the universities so what are the different universities that are participating so central universities state universities government institution deemed universities and the private universities but the problem is like you really do not know like what are the names of the universities and where they are located right so that's the reason like we have made a complete blog on this where if you just visit our website 
so just visit our website www.agreedit.in and so once you visit your website here there is a block section you just click on the block section here in this block section in the side there are categories in this category just click on the cvt pg agriculture so if you click on the cvt pg agriculture here you can see like we have given the complete list of the universities which are participating in cvt pg and most importantly in this departments which of the universities have the agriculture facilities that are also clearly given in this complete block so make sure to read it and analyze the things and just decide like where you want to pursue your msc in which of which of the subjects you are willing to do it okay so this is about the block next the universities are clear to everyone now like the links will be available in the description box either you can visit the website directly or click on the link that will be available in the description okay so this is regarding the participating universities next comes the most important questions see if you do not understand why like students will go for only bhu after writing the cvt pg exam so it's because of the main reason that because of the accreditation the icr has given the accreditation for the bhu for the msc so that's the main reason mostly the students are only interested in bhu otherwise if someone is interested in msc they will be writing icr pg exam or they will be going with their state entrance exam msc state entrance exam they will be cracking it and getting their seat in their home university only okay but in case of cvt pg only mostly the students will be focusing on the bhu so that's why we'll be talking about the bhu and the students asked us like what will be the marks or rank uh, should be scored to get the seat in bhu to understand this know that in bhu these are the following 11 departments for which you can apply for for the msc if you are willing to go for the msc take the admission in the msc for the bhu see these are the list of departments that you can go for see there are a lot of other departments which are missing from the list so which are available in the icr counseling so make sure that you know that you know that even in the plant science if you know it's only genetics and plant breeding and the plant pathology you don't find the seed science or neither agriculture microbiology here similarly for other subjects only the major subjects are included here the major dis disciplines are available for msc just check it before applying for this okay the complete list has been given here you can take a screenshot of it next other than the csc q p01 there are two sets of paper which you can write one is this if you are writing it and the second is like you can pick any of this and you can write the exam and you can apply for these disciplines also in case of bhg counseling okay so this is also for the bhg counseling which i'm talking about this is fine next next coming for the cutoff so these are the cutoff details for the different of different departments starting with the economics agronomy entomology extension plant pathology plant physiology genetics and plant breeding agriculture chemistry so complete details have been given here so you can just find the same details in our website i'll just show you like where to find this out so again if you just visit our website agreeaddict.in so click on blog and here in the side you can find the cvt pg Agri agriculture in this c the bhu cutoff for the agriculture subjects in the previous batch in the 2024 what was the cutoff what was the last marks to which like student has got the seat in the particular department has been clearly given in this complete table you can go and find this and you can predict whether you will be able to get the seats for this year or not okay and do not go with the previous year than the 2024 because it will not be relevant for you so make sure you just only check the 2024 cutoff details okay and if you generally ask me sir i want to pursue in gpb i want to pursue my degree in plant pathology so what should be my score like anything about 200 plus will be safe for out of 300 okay and if you are for fighting for G gpb like if you want to get the seat for gpb then you should be in the top 10 or top 5 only then you will be able to get the seats along with this cvt pg there are also the other quotas through which the bhu will take the admission one is like uh, like in service or the bhu seats or like so there will be also icr seats so there are a lot of sub a few other categories in which so the seats are also filled in the bhu the complete details of this is available in the brochure that will be released by the bhu once the counseling starts 
So next question would be like, when does the counseling of BHU starts? It generally starts in the month of June. The complete details regarding the counseling, I'll be making a detailed video on that once the counseling has been released. And also in the WhatsApp channel and Telegram channel, we'll be updating about the dates of the uh, BHU counseling once it is released. So you can join our WhatsApp channel or the Telegram channel and to get the timely updates regarding this exam. But remember and mark it that in the month of June, after getting the scorecard in the month of May, you will be able to eligible to apply for counseling. Okay, you have to apply for the individual universities separately if you are wanting to get admission through the CUET. Not like ICR, there will be a single counseling. There will be separate counseling for each of the universities and for BHU, there is separate counseling which you have to attend in the month of June. And what should be a priority? Uh, my marks is 2, uh, 2, 2, 10, 2, 15. What colleges i'll be getting so all these queries can be answered so once the counseling dates are announced and you will be getting the once uh, you get your scores okay but still like if you are curious to know about like what are the um, scores for which the departments have been announced you can visit our website and here uh, the our previous year toppers like cut pg toppers we have given the complete list so you can see like the students who have secured the top rank in these exams most of them in our website like they have got the plant pathology and genetics okay till 201 also the students have got um, the gpb but the criteria will be the some students might be uh, might have pursued their ug from bhu so there will be some extra quota that they will be having so cutoff will be less than the, less for them and the students who have written this cutpg exam cutoff will be slightly more than for them so this varies from year to year based on the competition so make sure you know this and if you have any doubts on this CUT counseling 2025 or the BHE counseling 2025 or the scorecard that is led by CUT or any other details if you want you can comment on this video and we are happy to assist. I hope like the video is informative and you have understood the different things and you can get the cutoffs from the website which I told you just visit www.agritech.in in the blog section you will be able to find all the cutoff details for the previous year that is for the 2024 okay. I hope these things are clear and regarding this fellowship if you do not know like if you are if you are admitting to bhu if you are admitting to bhu through cut pg even if you are securing the top rank in this exams you will not be awarded with any of any fellowship but same thing the for the same college if you are going with the icar pg exam if you are securing the top rank in this exams and then taking the seat in the BHU then you will be at least getting the ICR PG fellowship which is 12,640 per month for the period of two years and you will be also getting 6,000 per year contingency okay so that is not there in the CUT PG exams that is the main difference but when you talk about the fees and everything the fees in the BHU is minimal as of today till today like it is minimal compared to the many other state agriculture universities central agriculture universities deemed universities so it is mostly i can say it is affordable till now so you can go either to the cutpg or if you are preparing for the C icrpg concentrate on the preparation and go with the icrpg and students were also asking sir whether should i attend the cut uh, bhe counseling or not i am seriously pre preparing for icrpg and i want to take the seat through icrpg only anyhow whether you want to take the seat through icrpg or not doesn't matter but i would uh, suggest you like if you have secured a very good rank in this CUT PG exam then attend the BHA counseling get to know the things like how the things are done and get a second option for you like if you are alerted with some good department then keep it as an option so once your CUT PG exam is com completed then you can take a call like whether you to go for the ICR counseling or to settle with the CUT PG counseling and other than this like students were also asking like sir whether I have to attend the state entrance exams or not like uh, the GB Panth uh, university has recently called its uh, state entrance exam should i sir go for it or not should i only focus for icrpg see i would suggest you focus on one exam that is icrpg but still do not leave any other exams that you are getting try to attend all of the exams don't worry about the results whether i will go or not whether i'll get the seat or not what will your fellowship what will your fees just try to attend the questions that you are getting in the different exams that will definitely help you to boost your confidence before you attend this icrpg exam and this will get you a top rank in this icrpg I hope this video is informative and lot of students have um, have enrolled our CUT PG mock test bundle in the year 2025. We are also awaiting for the results. So the, once the results are announced, we'll be publishing it in our website and also in the YouTube channel and the Instagram page. So uh, all the very best for your results. And if you have any queries, you can drop a message anytime on this video.
thank you so much and all the details which i mentioned will be available as a link in the description box you can check it anytime and students if you are watching this video for the first time and if if you are writing the cut pg exam in the any of the upcoming years if you are not aware like what is cut pg exams what is the criteria eligibility so the complete blog link is also will be also available in the description just go and check it and prepare accordingly in the coming years okay and we are always here to guide you and assist you people contact us anytime for any kind of queries related to agriculture studies thank you